I'm Nancy Jo Lambert, and don't call me Nancy, and I love G Suite for Education. I use Google products every day with teachers and students to collaborate, teach, and learn. I want to become a Google certified trainer because while everyone on my campus knows that I'm knowledgeable, having this certification will increase my credibility. Also, as a presenter at educational conferences, I want other educators to feel confident in my skills because I'm a Google certified trainer. Within the state of Texas and nationally, I am known for being a tech-savvy librarian who loves to collaborate. As a Google certified trainer, you can rest assured that I will never be caught chewing gum in a training because I've never chewed gum in my life. Pretty unique, am I right? One of my passions is to empower my students and teachers to discover the magic of G Suite so they can up their productivity, presentation, and collaboration game. Google Keep is one of my favorite productivity tools. The collaboration features help teachers and students by allowing them to share their to-do lists, save links so they, can, so they are within reach from any device, note information by project for quick reference, organize notes with self-selected labels and categorize by color, and add collaborators to share their notes and resources. Now let's take a look at Google Keep in action. You can see that I have a National Honor Society to-do list shared with my NHS co-advisor. Here we can keep track of all the things we need to do for NHS and quickly mark them off when we've completed a task. As the current chair of the Texas Association of School Librarians, I have all the links to our TASL Lunch and Learn webinar resources on a keep note that I've shared with the person who's coordinating these webinars. My digital learning coach and I create meaningful technology projects using information for our teachers and students. We have a keep note that houses all the links to our projects for ease of access as we work on them and as we complete them, we mark them off. At the end of the year, it also provides us with a timeline of all the projects we did for the year. You'll notice I have many notes on my main page, but the most important and timely notes are pinned to the top. If I want to move a note to the top, I simply unpin it and pin it again. For each of these notes, I've categorized them by color and utilized the labels function. Now I can choose a label and see the notes that I assign for that particular label. When I'm through with a note, I can archive it and send it off to and send it off of my main page. Now it's time for you to embrace the magic of Google Keep and get started collaborating with others.